एवरीवन वेलकम टू अमर ज्योतिष क्रश वर्ल्ड टुडे आई एम हियर वंस अगेन विद माय न्यू ट्यूटोरियल टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू मेक एन इयर एंड इट्स अ पाइन एप्पल स्टिच इयर रिंग पाइन एप्पल इयर रिंग सो इट्स वेरी इजी वेरी क्विक टू मेक सो फॉर मेकिंग दिस वी नीड वेरी लिटिल थिंग्स लाइक वी नीड कॉटन थ्रेड एंड अ हुक टू अ हैंगिंग लूप और हुक टू हैंग इट एंड द क्रोशे हुक and pair of scissors so the thread that i am using is mercedized cotton thread right so mercedized cotton thread you can use for making this earring it can be made with the wool but uh, the look uh, the finishing that gives um, uh, to the earring is uh, comes with the thread only the crochet hook that i am going to use is 1.75 crochet hook Uh, 1.75 mm crochet hook pair of scissors and a hanging loop or hook any colors silver or golden it's your wish right so let's quickly begin making this beautiful and easy and quick pineapple earring or pineapple stitch earring right so first of all we have to start from the top and then go at the bottom so it's a top down project right so for starting make a slip knot chain 5 1 2 3 4 5 chain 5 and slip stitch in the first chain so that a ring can be formed it's very small but uh, the center you can find easily so in this ring i'm not using magic uh, circle and i'm using chain 5 and uh, using it as a, a ring use a, as a circle right so in this ring or circle start making uh, sorry just ha so after slip stitching chain 1 and in the in this ring start making single crochet so total 12 single crochet we have to make 1 2 3 take the tail along with 4 five 6 7 8 9 10 Eleven and last twelve. Right? You can see a ring with twelve single crochet. Now slip stitch in the first single crochet. So this first portion of ring is done. Now chain one, chain one will be considered as your first um, single crochet. In the same stitch, make one more single crochet. Right? So like this, you have to make two single crochet in total five stitches. So one is this. In second stitch, make two single crochet. In third stitch, make two single crochet. In fourth stitch, two single crochet. And in the fifth stitch, make two single crochet. So total ten single crochet you have. Leaving this, and because we will be make uh, hanging the loop over here, so this. this is the top and like this we are moving downwards right and here we will be working over okay this round 2 is done with 10 single crochet now make chain 3 chain 3 considered as our first double crochet chain 1 as the divider between two double crochets turn your work so total four chains we i have made chain 3 as our double crochet and one chain as the divider between the double crochets so in the next stitch make a double crochet chain 1 in the next stitch again make a double crochet chain 1 double crochet chain 1 double crochet chain 1 double crochet chain 1 Double crochet, chain one, double crochet, chain one, and the last one, 
double crochet so see how many we have done 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 because here if I make it will make 10 so you can see over here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 I'm not making it the last chain one of last round I'm just leaving nine double crochet with chain one spaces right now start with chain three turn your work now in the space you can find the first space in this space make one double crochet chain one and in the same space make two double crochet right this is the first space now make chain three in the next space make a single crochet chain three in the next space make single crochet chain three in the next space make a single crochet chain three in the next space make a single crochet chain three next space single crochet chain 3 in this space make a single crochet and chain 3 so total how many chain 3's and single crochets I have done so 1 2 3 4 5 times I have made it a loop and here chain 3 and single crochet this side and single crochet and chain 3 this side so 5 times I have made it a design right now the last space you have found in this we are going to make the same shell that we have made the first time two double crochets chain one and two double crochets this was for the first time and for the rest time i'll be making the shell as two double crochet chain two and two double crochet right now turn your work slip stitch don't slip stitch in the current stitch skip this and go to the next one that is the second double crochet slip stitch over here and slip stitch in between the chain space now make chain three one double crochet oops one double crochet chain two and two double crochet This is your exact shell that we will be making for the rest of the pattern. For the first time, just two double crochets and two double crochets are divided with one, one chain space. Now make chain three. Now you will find the first this loop. Do not make it in this loop that was connecting loop. Skip this loop, go in this chain three and make a single crochet now again chain three and in the next chain three make a single crochet chain three and in the next space make a single crochet chain three in the next space make a single crochet chain three in the next space make a single crochet chain three so how many times I have made single crochet? 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 times single crochet and 4 circular loops. Right? Last time I had 5 circular loops. This time I have decreased to 4 circular loops. After making chain 3, find the center of your shell. After 2 double crochet there is a chain 1 space. In that make a shell once again. 2 double crochet chain 2 and 2 double crochet right this was your 1 2 3 4 and 5 row number 5 now turn your work again do not make slip stitch in the first stitch in which you are working skip that go in the next double crochet and then make a slip stitch and again slip stitch in chain 2 space chain 3 one more double crochet chain 2 and 2 more double crochet in the same space this is your shell chain 3 
slip stitch uh, sorry uh, single crochet in the first chain 3 loop chain 3 again make a single crochet in the next space chain 3 in the next space make a single crochet chain 3 in the last space make a single crochet so this time I have made 3 loops with 4 single crochet and make a, the last one chain 3 the connecting loop and go in the in between the shell and make another shell the shell comprises of 2 double crochet chain 2 and 2 double crochet this is your row number 6 turn your work skip the current double crochet slip stitch in the next double crochet and slip stitch in between the shell so chain 3 is our first double crochet one more double crochet chain 2 and two more double crochet in the same chain 2 space your first shell is done chain 3 go in the first loop make a single crochet chain 3 in the next loop make a single crochet chain 3 in the next loop make a single crochet this time I have made three single crochet and two loops right and the last chain 3 is connecting loop and shell in the shell 2 double crochet chain 2 and 2 double crochet right this was row number 7 turn your work skip the current double crochet in the next double crochet make a slip stitch slip stitch in chain 2 space chain 3 for as first double crochet one more double crochet chain 2 and two more double crochet in the same chain two space chain three single crochet in the first loop chain three single crochet in the next loop this time I have made two time single crochet and only one circular loop chain three connecting loop and shell in the shell two double crochet chain two and two double crochet turn your work slip stitch in the next double crochet and slip stitch in the chain 2 space 2 double crochet uh, uh, sorry 3 chain 3 as first double crochet and 1 more double crochet chain 2 and 2 more double crochet in the chain 2 space as our first shell chain 3 now as we have only one loop so we will be making one single crochet in that and no uh, circular loop just a connecting loop of chain 3 and shell in the shell 2 double crochet chain 2 2 double crochet right this was your row number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 this was row number 9. Turn your work. Slip stitch to the center of your shell. Chain 3 and 1 double crochet. Chain 2. 2 more double crochet in the same chain 2 space. Now this time no loops, no connecting loops, no circular loops. Just leave it as it is and then shell in the next shell. This shell is connected automatically 2 double crochet chain 2 and 2 more double crochet this was your row number 10 turn your work slip stitch back to the center of your shell now make chain 3 start making double crochet yarn over insert the hook yarn over you have 3 loops yarn over and pull through first two loops and leave it as it is do not complete your double crochet yarn over go in the next shell insert the hook yarn over and pull the loop you have four loops right now yarn over and pull through first two loops leave the three loops in your hook yarn over again go in the chain two space yarn over and pull through first two loops now you have four loops in the hook yarn over and pull through all the four loops chain one and cut the yarn so finish it off 
right pull the tail to tighten it and then hide the yarn completely so this will be your front side you can see these stitches a braid like these stitches are in front this is the front side at the back side the wrong side you will see so this is the front side so at the back side I am hiding my thread in between the loose ends because these are double crochets so carefully find out the loops and then start hiding your loose end It's not hard and fast tool that you have to hide till this stitch or that stitch. Just hide wherever it can go and then just cut the yarn, cut the tail and then your earring is ready and uh, take the hanging hook or hanging loop, open its mouth. this much and then from the front side here is the center just insert the both the stitches both the V's in it and then close it you can use the pliers but these are soft enough to be done with the fingers so that's it your beautiful quick easy and so gorgeous casual wear party wear any color you can make with magic with your dress the earrings are ready just block these earrings if you want to make it and uh, wear it immediately just spray with the hard um, um, that hairspray the super hard hairspray and then these will be ready and if you have time, you have made it and leisurely you can use it. Then uh, dip in the glue water solution and then lay them flat uh, on flat surface and then let it dry by itself. Do not dry in the sun. Just leave it in the normal shade and uh, in the, on room temperature. It will automatically get dry up. You, it's your creativity. You can attach beads at the end. The hanging beads will, can be there or you can leave it as it is so hope you like my video on, on um, making this beautiful and gorgeous earrings and pineapple earrings please give it a like uh, thumbs up please like share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for each and every um, update i'll make on my channel that notification you will get and uh, if you have any queries if you have any suggestions please do write in the comment section your suggestions your comments i really love um, your comments and your suggestions are always welcome i try to work on that and uh, thank you for watching my channel thank you once again